developed, created, and owned by James Pro Artistry Productions. Perceptive readers, welcome to the James Pro Artistry Productions podcast, which is the evolved Perceptive Readers podcast that you have listened to for years. Yes, with the migration to different platforms now, you can find us on iHeartRadio once again, uh, Spotify, and others, Stitcher, and others, where you can subscribe there to the James Poe Artistry podcast. Today, I want to talk about the talent of Dilraba Dimlaret in the East and West. Who is this person? Well, I put a post up and I just want to read it to you uh, to make you aware. There are times a recommended profile of an individual social media account is taken as good advice. Dear Rabba Dimarat turns out to be this good advice for many in the Earth's internal and external metasphere. And yes, Metasphere has come more into light, you know, since the internet age as well. Uh, so you, you think about the metaverse. Well, the metasphere is still all dealing with the internet all around the world. Yes, we are all connected in this way. And yes, the Araba is certainly once again, uh, moving up the charts, so to speak. You see, with the above being stated in this paragraph, I've created more commentaries and recommendations than can be counted over the years, as you know. Uh, there are enthralling interests, talents, and you see that these people that I mentioned, they have more uh, talents than what people even know at times. And so, you know, I like to bring that out. And so, in the eastern lands, uh, Diraba is very well known, you see, in China, if you will, a China star. And yet, as she continues to branch out, you see, with her uh, different talents of movies and dramas and things of that nature, uh, she's not known only in China, but as you can see that I'm making this uh, uh these comments right now that she's known even in the United States. Yes, uh, she has a fan site as well. One of them, a YouTube channel, uh, that I believe the person really is, uh, stationed, you see, right here in the United States. Therefore, speaking of the talent of dear Robert, dear Murat, uh, is a person loved by many Eastern lands, as I said, like China. And the reason why uh, she has uh, talents from acting to modeling to song and dance. Yes, if you take a look at the fan site that she has, and I did, I placed a link in this article, then you will appreciate her modeling for sure. And there are some videos out there that show her, um, you know, doing choreography and dancing and things of that nature, not just by herself, uh, but with others. So, hey, maybe if you get a chance, you can go over to that fan site. I've already done it. Uh, I actually made a, a comment uh, about, you know, how well put together and the thoughts uh, behind it of this uh, creator who, uh, you know, works hard on creating those videos for her. And um, the person actually did respond back basically with a thank you. And so at the very least, uh, check out the video link, you see, that I did share in this one post. And maybe uh, when I post this video to my website, because right now, as you can see, this is on the James Paul Artistry uh, Productions uh, podcast. But as I actually create a post, you see, uh, place this on my website as well. Uh, I think I will place, uh, that link in there as well to make it easy for you. So, uh, thank you for being with me, uh, on this episode of the James Poe Artistry Productions. 
Uh, I hope you've been enjoying it on these different platforms now. <laughs> you see, uh, more than just having to go to parkbooks.com. Uh, but yes, again, you have Spotify, uh, you have iHeartRadio, you have Stitcher, and there are others as well. So have a very uh, wonderful day. And please, hey, you may be doing yourself a big favor if you go to check out the Araba de Moret, uh channels, you see, and her talent. Have a very wonderful, wonderful day.